Stop. I'm telling you, girls. Stop. We will say what you know. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Please. Let's go. You guys don't believe me. Please. Let's go. Let's go. Carry your pocket. Let's go. Say what you know. See, let me tell you. I love you. Yeah. I love you, baby. Yeah. My sister, have you heard? Heard what? The king has declared the princess open for marriage. You mean that ritualist? Who will marry that thing that you have already disfigured? I pray that all men should keep their distance away from that royal family. I thank God that all my children are in Lagos. One at Onicha. I pray that evil eyes will never see them and they will never hear anything about that news at all. Hmm. Surely they will hear. Are they not in our youth dance meeting over there? What if any of them hears it and indicates interest? God forbid. I will go to any length to stop that interest from any of them. Don't say that to Remember, whosoever that marries the princess becomes the prince. And when the king dies, the mantle of kinship falls on him. They should go and die with their kinship. None of my son will marry from that family. Never. Anyway, I'm also skeptical about it too. You do? Yes, of course. Now, wow, me, I can't do. Let's go. My sister, let's go. Yeah, I am my Baby, I'm dying for you. Have you heard that the princess has been declared open to marriage by the king of our land? He said that this morning. Have you heard it? Eh? What kind of rumor is that? If anything happens in the palace, I'll know before you are more closer to the palace than you are. And who, who said it's a rumor? Eh? It is everywhere. The news is everywhere. Everybody now knows that the princess is open. She is now declared open to marriage by any man. You know, even as I was coming from the palace, I saw one man who was just walking majestically. He said, Omo, <laughs> I said, it be like this, now we go marry the princess. So, you know, everybody, all the young men in this village, everybody is just happy. Uh, and I asked myself, what about you? Huh? Every day you tell me you're in love with the princess. So, does it mean that the royal household have no regard, no respect for you regarding your feelings to the princess? Well, maybe there is nothing to regard. The princess and I share a mutual relationship, more or less brothers and sisters. Huh? Brothers and sisters. You, Chikelu, share a relationship with the princess. You see her like a sister and she sees you like a brother. Who are you deceiving? Who are you lying to? Listen, better check your heart. Eh? You start checking your heart now to know if you're actually telling me the truth. Because I think something is wrong with you. You told me the other day that you're in love with the princess. So now you're telling me that she's like a sister to you and you're like a brother. Hey! Something is fishy. Something is fishy because in a twinkle of an eye, another man will take your love and you'll be here pretending. You'll be here pretending. You'll be here pretending someone will just come and take away your princess, your love. Everybody! See that man going there, ask him. Everybody knows! Everybody is ready. What is going on between you and the princess? He's like a sister to you, and you're like a brother. Uh-uh! You don't even know. You are here now. You want to start brushing your teeth. You don't even know that the woman you claim you love is about to be given out. Because something... Hey, 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 chicken. Where are you going? Eh? Where are you going? I came to look for you now. You're leaving me behind. Why? I need to see the princess. <laughs> Leia. Leia. You need to see the princess. I thought you just said now that the princess is like a sister to you. And you're like a brother to her. So, why are you nervous? Hey! My city, I let me just you. Me... Hey! Oh, you're even running. You are running, chicken. Eh? Liar! It's why I keep calling you liar. You're a liar. Look at this one. You don't even know what you want. You're in love with someone else. Can you can you imagine my friend? Eh? Hey, Chigalu! 
Don't go to the palace now and start crying, you know. Don't start crying there. No, no, no. I'm feeling for you. My love for you is unconditional, baby. My love for you is for me. Love is oh, for yeah. me. I need some proof for you to understand my feelings for you. No, no, no. I need some time for you to know that I cannot do without you. I'm dying for you. Chicken, you will live long. I was just about coming to your place. So it is true. I am as surprised as you are. I don't know why my parents had to announce that I am open for marriage. Without even seeking for my own opinion. It doesn't make sense. It doesn't make sense at all. Why would they make decisions for you without your consent? I mean... I don't know why my father and mother are bent on getting me married. But like you said, I have to obey them. They are my parents. Well, yes, you... You have to obey them, but not at the expense of your, of your happiness. Your happiness comes first. Do you know the man in question? You know the kind of person. What if he has mouth order? What if, what if he's a terrible person? What if he's a woman beater? What if his armpits are smelling? Just trust my parents. I trust my parents. Don't make the right choice for me. Wait. You. You are in in support of, of their decision. I don't have a choice. You have a choice. You have. So you, you have a choice. You don't know who this man is. You don't, you don't know if he's, if he's good enough for you. I mean, marriage is it's a lifetime thing. It's not it's just something you want to spend with someone you don't know. You have to know someone to want to marry that person. You have to be rest assured that this person will bring you nothing but happiness. Your happiness comes first. No one has indicated interest yet. Chikelu. Yes. Do you think any man will want to marry me? I wish you could see through my heart and see how much you are dead to me. At least be happy for your sister. I've been declared open for marriage. Who knows? Lock my smile at me. I'm in love with you. I cannot pretend. From the depth of my heart, I love you. I'm in love I'm dying for you. I'm dying for you, baby. Mama. I love you. I love you, baby. My love for you is unconditional, baby. My love for you is for real. Love is oh, for yeah. me. I need some proof for you to understand my feelings for oh, you. No, no, no. I need some time for you to know that I cannot do without you. I'm dying for your love. I'm dying for you. I love you for real. I love you, baby. So, this is it. 
the king, the king can possibly say he doesn't know about my feelings for her. If he had asked me out, He asked who my father was. I saw the expression in his face when I said, I'm going to up. I knew they would definitely ignore my feelings. <laughs> who would want to give his princess? His daughter, the son of a palm wine tapa. Of course, the son of a of a palm wine tapa does not merit. What should I say? Is it worthy of a princess? assume the king does not care what she says she doesn't know of my of my love for her Princess has been declared open for marriage. Mm -hmm. I'm aware. But there is no suitor yet. That is the main reason you should stay away from her. Or are you ready for marriage? Why are you saying this to me? Hey, Mama, why are you speaking to me like this? Why? My son, you need to stop running around her. It will scare away suitors from her. You know you are close to her. But you are not of the same class. The only person that can marry her is a rich man. A man that is well to do. You don't have that money. I understand why you are saying this. Stop beating around the bush. You will not accept her as your daughter-in-law because of her condition, I know. God forbid that I judge her with her condition. And I learned her father used her for ritual. What kind of talk is that? What kind of stupid talk is that? Who told you? Who's been feeding you with this baseless rumors? Who? Veronica told me earlier today. And people have been saying it. Am I not so disappointed in you? Veronica. Veronica! Mother of a criminal? A woman who condones her son, teaches her son the ways of evil? That's the woman that you are listening to. That's the one that gave you all this baseless rumor. That's the woman my mother is listening to. Really? Take a look. What one or two persons is saying? This atom of truth in it. All I am saying is that you should be careful and stay out of trouble. That's all I am saying. Thank you. 
Thank you. I believe you must have heard the news that the princess is open for marriage. <laughs> <laughs> Mama, Mama, stop acting like a clown. Huh? What, is, what is all this laugh? What do you mean by acting like a clown? I'm saying something serious and you're laughing. What is funny about what I just said? <laughs> because, Mama, I don't know what you're trying to say that. How is the issue of, how is the issue pertaining the princess getting married being a serious one? And how does it concern you? Uh, no, I, I don't understand. Oh, let me announce to you that it does. How? It does concern you. Mama, how? Because I want you to marry her. Mama, let me ask you. Who straight thinking man would ask for the hand of a vegetable in marriage? No, tell me, Mama. A man who just woke up in the morning and go to the palace and say he wants to marry the princess. Hmm. Wait, though. Is it the way she, she, she walks? Or the way she talks? Hey. She is not even presentable. Who is talking about presentation? Eh? Who is asking you to go for presentation? Let me tell you. Whether she is like vegetable or bono or a goosey, anyhow she is, you must marry her. Open an ear, so get ready. So easy. Mama, so easy. So easy, Mama. In that case, you should have told me that you called me out here for jokes. I know you have improved in your jokes telling, but this is your particular joke. This one is expensive. Hey, 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 I don't want that nonsense. So. Don't tell me any nonsense. I am not here for a joke. Look at you. Look at you. I'm trying to pave way for you. Don't you know that if you marry the princess now, you stand a better chance of being the heir apparent to the throne of this kingdom. Don't you know? So easy. Yes. Mama, so easy. Automatically. Just like that. Mm. In that case, I have to get a shaving stick and shave my public hair. Use the money for ritual. So that I can now marry the princess and become the prince. In fact, I don't want to be the prince. I want to be the king. Let me just jump to the king. There's e no point. Egbunike, don't joke with me. But mama, you started the joke first. Egbunike, don't joke with mama, me. Mama, you started the joke first. Egbunike, e Pashara Nyago. Okay, let me ask you, mama. You are telling me to go and marry the princess. What about that one that is always hovering around her like a fly? What you, about him? You mean that stupid chikelu? Yes, or, chikelu. Or, or even chicken. That one? That one is even worse than the princess now. That one is no more alive. He's already dead. Don't you see the way he's looking? He's not even seeing well. I'm sure he's blind. He must have been blind by now. You see, but you know what? Forget that one. I am the one in charge. I am the one calling the shots. I've already told the mother what she needs to hear. And I'm sure she must have passed the message across to him. Mama, Mama, <laughs> your blood is too hot. <laughs> Always a point. <laughs> There's no time. There's no time. We move. There's no time for frivolities. You must marry the princess. This is purely business. I want you to start seeing things from my own point of view. I want you to start seeing things from my own perspective. That is the only way you can make heaven. My man, Egwedike. There is something I want to tell you. I want to leave this village and go to the city where I can make real money. But you are making money from the selling of land business. That is not the kind of money I'm talking about. I am talking about the money that comes in hard currency. I remember warning you on how you spend. But you said money is meant for spending. Have you seen it? I don't know how you reason sometimes. The kind of money I am talking about is the money you spend and you will never notice you are spending any money. Not this kind of money here in the village. I don't, I don't, I don't, know, I don't know how you think. Uh, Why are you always thinking backward? Keep pressing forward. Mm. Uh, let me ask you. If you are not diligent in managing 
the money that you make in this village. How sure are you to be diligent in the one you call currency that you want to make in the city? My problem with you is that your, your reason is so low. Your sense of reason is so low. You are seeing it in, as a, in a carnal man way. You are not seeing it as an, a candidate of heaven. Can I ask you a question? Do you think this city you are talking about is a place you go and pluck money like leaves? How oh, See, let me tell you. If you can feel it, then you can see it because I believe I can fly. If you feel that going to the city, that you have money to plug on the tree, then definitely when you get to the city, you will see money to plug on the tree. As a man thinking, so he is. Obonike, Biko, 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 do, do, do. Can we stop dreaming? Let's face reality. Biko, what? I don't even know why I brought up this issue with you at the first place. I'm supposed to meet people who have sense of humor. Those who think like me, heavily candidates. If I should tell you that I'm going to the city to make money because of the princess, the same girl that I've been mocking her condition, you will laugh at me. No. I won't tell you anything. See, eh, Obudika, let me tell you one thing. Eh? Obudna. Obudika. Obudika. What is it? Nothing, nothing. I think I have to go home now. I need some rest. Is it because of what I have been saying? No, 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 no. I just have to go home. Hmm? I'll see you later, huh? As much as you just hide uh, Take it easy now. Open now. City is not where you go and play around. Obwinania, Biko, please forget about women. Forget about rape. Focus on your goal and achieve it. Mama, Biko. mama, you are not speaking to a, a child. You are talking to a grown up man. I know. I know I'm talking to a grown up man. And I also know what, I, what you're capable of. I know what you're capable of. When you get to the city, shine your eye. Shine your eye. It's a different ball game when you get to the city. So nam badanya ifeba ne butike butike. Mama. Lay your hand on anything buteremike. That's all I want from you. Mama, hmm? I have heard you. Mm -hmm. And I promise you one thing. I will never disappoint you. I trust you. Trust me. I trust you, my son. Is it not you again? Are you no more the son of Veronica, the lioness? Now go and make me proud. You know, go. Mama, trust eh? me. I trust you. Trust you. Uh, go and succeed. My queen, <laughs> and together, we shall rule and make this kingdom. Yes. You say, Mama. I will go. Go and succeed. Mama, I will go. Go and make and it. And I will come back with money. Mm -hmm, now. I will come back successfully. You will make heaven. Trust me, Mama. <laughs> go and succeed and make heaven. Mama, that's why, that's why when you tell me that I can kill everybody, I will make it. You will make and it. And I'm going to make money. You make money Trust and me. make heaven. Thank you, Mama. Yes, now. Mama. Go, make it and make heaven. I will come back, Mama. Oh, yeah, Mama. Yes, oh. That's not possible. You know too well it's not possible. I can't stay without seeing the princess. Princess is more like the air I breathe. It means if I don't see the princess, I'll die. I have to see her to stay alive. Okay, let's assume that I decide to heed to her advice. You think the princess can stay one day without seeing me? You think it's possible? If I do that, it will hurt her and I am not ready to do that. Chikelu. If I can remember vividly, you are the same one that told me that the princess wants you to obey your parents. Mm -hmm. Right? Mm -hmm. So, are you thinking what I'm thinking? 
Do you think you're sharing the same vision with her? Why not you pave way for suitors to come in and keeping her all to yourself? Chico, let me ask you. Do you want to be a poor man and also a witch? I'm not standing on anyone's way. Whoever wants to marry the princess should go ahead and marry her. I'm not stopping anybody. Now you're saying a different thing. You're saying a different thing. But let's just watch and see nature takes its course. Upstairs, she's in inside sleeping. Yes. Now you're leaving so soon. Why didn't she see you off? Um, I'm afraid, Your Majesty, she's a bit weak, so I just didn't want to bother her. So, so. all right. In that case, I hope we'll see you tomorrow. Of course, Your Majesty, I'll be here on time. All right. I'll see you upon. She will hear. She will hear. Greetings, Your Majesty. All right. Good night. What exactly is going on? Like what? Are you the one that permitted him to go upstairs? To see the princess in her bedroom? Yes, I did. And what is wrong with that? Everything is wrong. Yes. It's been months. Yes, months have gone by, crawling into a year since we announced the princess availability, but no one had shown up. So I decided to see if those two can make out something out of uh, this uh, relationship. At least uh, they'll be able to realize what they have for each other. That is what will make him to tell the princess his mind. Oh. Yeah, I, I, I remember. I remember that was our initial arrangement. Why didn't you draw my attention to it? It doesn't matter now. You have to follow suit and treat him like one of us. It's okay. In that case, I'll resume my lecturing them on how to understand themselves. Yeah. Exactly, my love. Mm. I think I need to go sleep. I'm tired from the job. Oh, come on. You'll be fine, huh? Good night. Good night. Uh. Come out! 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 Come out!
He was just joking. 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 Great. Great. Tell him you're joking. Hey! 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 Point of correction. Chief. Ubumado. Ejenga. I kill, but I don't go to prison. Chigelo, your worst enemy is back. Sometimes you don't fight for something. Sometimes you don't drive for something. Sometimes nature will take its place. Ebonike! Ebonike! Ebonike is back. With the car. Bodyguards. Eh? He kills. And he doesn't go to prison. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Eh? Are you thinking what I'm thinking? It's about to be a rap for you in this village. How hard you try to get it If it's not your own It cannot work no. The power of nature I'm looking for your son, Ebonike. Your son, Ebonike, came to the city and stole my money. Hi! Uncle CJ. Uncle CJ. Please. 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 Please, sir. Chief, Biko. Biko, forgive my son. That is not what I sent him to go and do. I'm sure there's a mix up somewhere. Maybe he has joined bad boys that led him into this. Biko, forgive him. If you see this, my son, eh? he is a very, very gentle boy. Very gentle, very small, very tiny boy yo, that is working so hard to make heaven. Biko, forgive him. If, if all this your boys should pass on him, there will be nothing left. Oh. There will be nothing left out of him. Biko, Biko forgive my son. Biko, oh. He has not come back from the city. Oh. I haven't even seen him. Biko, nam, oh. You want me to forgive your son? Yes! I have heard you. <laughs> you will make heaven, oh? I will forgive your son. Hey! You will make heaven! Oh? You will make heaven. But only on one condition. Huh? Turn around. Face your door. Oh, because no, no, because no, no, because Turn around! Hey! Face your door! Oh, because... See my head, oh! <laughs> Money. 
I have gone to the city. You got I have like brought money for this village. Hey! You know hey. what? Hey! You know what? Hey. I want you to go and prepare. Hey. I'm taking you out. Hey. Let me take care of you. Hey. Change you. Hey! Hey, you don't want Mama. Hey. Yes. Hey. Mama. You put the gun in the Pentecost. Mama, listen. You get Pentecost. Listen, Mama. Who they were not does he? Listen, Mama. Who they were not so? I am no longer the able to get used to know. Is it gonna? Yes. And I go by the title, Chief Obumado Ejonga. I kill, but I never go to prison. Hey! One of the whole the whole kingdom. You will make heaven, Mama. Hey! I made it. Hey! Enough money. Okay, then. Too much money in okay, my bank account. Yeah! Too much money yeah! in my bank account. You know what, you? Hey. I am taking you out. <laughs> Let me go and flush you and change you and make you look like somebody. Mm, like, bam, 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 bam. What is that shoe? Hey, buddy, hmm? you will not go anywhere with Timo. Hey? This boy will not make heaven. You saw people with gun and you run away. Uh, allowing me to, uh, allow, I want them to kill me up, eh? Mama, 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 I came back with too much money. He came back to Mama, but I want to the city to bring money. He came back to cost. I brought the money. Mama, let's go inside. He came back to cost. Let's go inside. Here, here, here. As soon as I got to the city, I met a friend and told him I was looking for a job. Mm -hmm. So he introduced me to a man that lives in Spain but has so many warehouses in the city. Mm -hmm. The man was looking for someone that will manage his warehouse. Mm -hmm. And luckily for me, I got the job. Eh? So. I was managing all his warehouses. It's you. I served him very well. Mm. And he was very happy with me. It's you. And he gave me one of his warehouses to start with. Oh. And that was where I started. And this is me today. How? Hi! Hey, Are you saying that all these things happen in just this short period of time? Are you surprised? I catch you, I catch you, You must make heaven. Thank you, Mama. Yeah, yeah. It all happened like a magic. Whosoever that God chooses to bless, He bless. Mama. So who am I to say no? When God has said yes. When God has said yes. <laughs> Hey! hey. <laughs> so, who am I? <laughs> who am I that God has found favor in me? Can you imagine of all the young men in this community that went to the city? You are the only one that went. You saw. You conquered. Yes, Mama. <laughs> you went to the city, voted him in Pentecost. Hey! Hey! So very soon, very soon, I, Veronica, will be addressed as her royal majesty. Yeah, majesty. You can say that again. <laughs> Your majesty. Hey! Hey! hey. <laughs> Who am I? Hi, yeah, yeah. Hey, Namo. Chief Obumado Ejenga, one of the whole Ewulu kingdom. I kill and I never go to prison. Biko, can you tell your friends to come and sit down? Because, you know, hey, Mama, don't worry about them. Let them keep standing. That is why I am paying them. Oh. If a man must not walk, let him not eat. Mm -hmm. This is where they get what they eat. How? Oh. Eh? Chief, <laughs> His Royal Majesty. Hey, Mama. You don't need to be cruel to the people that are working for you now. Eh? Mama, uh -huh. don't bother about them. Hmm? We will soon be living here now for the hotel. When we get to the hotel, I will check them in and they have enough rest. Uh -huh. And if you don't mind, you can also follow us. Let's 
that you want room so that you can chill and enjoy yourself. Me? <laughs> yes, Mama. Yeah. You mean you are not going to sleep here? Ah, uh -uh, Mama, how can? Mama, how can? How do you expect Chief Obumado one? Obumado, a one, one of the whole Ewulu kingdom. Mm -hmm. The man that kills without going to prison <laughs> to sleep here now with this my level. It's not possible now. It's oh. not possible. That reminds me. I am going to bring people to this man to this house within the next three weeks. Ula. So that I'm going to erect a magnificent mansion. A yes. defeating mansion yes. for you where you'll be chilling hey. and flossing. Oh, get it. Oh, get it. Yes, Baba. Oh, get it. Yes, hey. Baba. But uh, me, I don't want to go and sleep in the hotel. Oh. If I follow you to the hotel, who would look after my house for me? Mama, eh? I know, I know. <laughs> I know. Mama, eh, Mama, Mama, eh, maybe I will go and represent you. I will go with you. Hey, Ekwedike. Ekwedike. You can follow who no road. That's the way to make heaven. You see, uh, <laughs> I am going to change your looks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. From now on, but you, you can never look like this again. <laughs> <laughs> is it this your beard? Yeah. I am going to tint it for you. <laughs> change your costume. Even this your palm, you will no longer wear it. Everybody care. Now you will know the meaning. What is a friend in need? It's a friend in need. Now you must make. Heaven. You must add weight. Very yeah, 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 yeah. You yeah. must add weight <laughs> in this village. Everybody care. Yes. You must make heaven. Chide <laughs> can. What a friend for us. Chide can now. Hey. Yeah. Mumwa, uh, Her Royal Majesty. Uh, Greetings, Your Majesty. Greetings, Your Highness. Greetings, Your Man. You're welcome to the Royal Palace of the Wulu Kingdom. Sit down. Thank you, Your Majesty. <clears throat> so, what do I offer you? Nothing, Your Majesty. Uh, Your Majesty, I'm actually here on a serious business transaction. Uh, which is? About you should have taken something first. Um, Your Majesty, don't worry about that. I'm okay. My name is Chief Ebunike, Chief Ogu One of Ewul Kingdom. Are you from this kingdom? Of course, Your Majesty. And who confirmed this title on you? Uh, actually, Your Majesty. I was given the title by my friends that I live together with in Singapore. Most of them are from this village. Mm -hmm. But now that I'm in the village, I am looking forward to cement the title after my marriage. What about your father? He has gone to the world beyond. Oh, sorry about that. Of course, Your Majesty, you know if my father was alive, I wouldn't be talking of becoming a chief. So have you come to invite me to your marriage ceremony? Not really, Your Majesty. Um, Your Majesty, when I was in Singapore, I heard about your daughter's availability in marriage. So I had to come down to confirm it, so that I would declare my interest. Wow, that's wonderful. You mean you flew all the way from Singapore to Nigeria? Yes, Your Majesty. Yes, you had well. Our daughter, you have not met her. But to be honest with you, she has some challenges. I don't know if you will like her. Your Majesty, I already know about your daughter's Disability. But you see, when it comes to marriage, what matters most is love. Because love covers everything. If she loves me and I love her, then we are good to go. Yes, yeah, she will. I have no doubt about that. So in that case, I have to inform my baby. So I'll get back to you as soon as we face a date. 
for the introduction. All right, uh, that's all right. But uh, please, what do you do for a living? Your Majesty, I import electronics. I'm also into real estate and um, natural resources like oil and gas. That's good. Um, Your Majesty, I will be on my way now. I have another business appointment to catch up with. All right. Uh, you said you will not take our cola. That would be next time. Do not worry about that, Your Highness. Maybe when I come for the introduction, we'll have enough time to do justice to the cola nuts. That's all right. I think we will see you off. <sighs> Said you should come inside. You need to have a word with you. So go inside. Chicken or you may go. You asked a question on who that man was. He is from this village. He goes by the title Obu, and he just flew in from Singapore. You see, my daughter, the people are not judged by the way they look. Someone can be very gentle and nice looking, but has a very bad heart. And someone could be looking very ugly, but his heart is filled with goodness. And so a man's action is not judged by the way he looks, my dear. Uh, oh, you just said you don't like her. Yes, Mom. You need to like her. Why? He was here to seek for your hand in marriage. My hand in marriage? Yes. You know, it's been a long time that we announced your readiness to get married. But no one has shown up since then. And suddenly, uh, this wealthy man appeared, and I am very sure he is from a uh, reputable family. My daughter, we're not getting you married to this man because he's rich. It's because he's a responsible man. Oh, good home. In fact, we were shocked when he said that he knows you. Not regarding the fact that he lives miles away in Singapore. Dad, I will need some time to think about this. Take all the time in the world, my dear. Sorry. I need to go to my room now and rest. Who yeah I I I I am I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I
I repeat, I don't want to ever see you near the princess. What is going on here? Ebuniki, what is it? Point of correction, madam. Chief Obumadu Ejanga. I kill and I don't go to prison. And I will kill this boy here. And I will not go to prison. Tell him to stay away from the princess. I will not want to repeat myself. You're moved by that? Oh, because he, he, he has made little money to, to buy guns. We should now start running, running away from him. He will kill me as a boy. He will kill me and he won't go to sell as a rat, as a nobody. No, let's see about that. He, he, he called me a boy right in front of you. You didn't say anything. No, no, no problem. He will kill me and he won't go to sell because, because I'm, I'm a child. I'm a rat that he will just kill just like that. Listen, mama, nothing will make me leave the princess for him. The princess belongs to me and that's it. What was that? Let's go. I'm not going. Mama, 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 please. I want to be left alone. Sometimes you don't fight for something. So it is true. Sometimes you don't drag for something. Sometimes nature will take its place. Oh no. No, no, no. Answer me. So it is true. Yes, it is true. Are you satisfied from what you want to hear? My king, I... Are you not happy that your sister is getting married? I am. Your Majesty, I am happy, but not that, not that good for nothing, man. He's not good enough for her. Who are you need to decide on what is good and what is not good for my daughter? Best thing that ever happened to me ever since I set eyes on her. I've always known that I love your daughter. You love her. I love her. Does she know that you love her? For how long have you been with my daughter without telling her that you love her? For this is the first and last time I will see you in this palace. And if you constitute an obstacle to my daughter's marriage, I will smite you. God! Take him out of here. Your Majesty, I... Shh. Shut up. Get out. Move. Get out. Get out. I'm in love with you. Move. I cannot pretend. From the depth of my heart. I love you. Nyemo bigi. Onyem furunanya. Yeah, more biggie. Oh, yeah. 
from the princess. Somebody has asked for her hand in marriage. There's nothing you can do about it. If you should start interfering now, you are causing problems for them. Now, Ogunike can kill for his wife to be. Princess! Princess Ihedima is not Ogunike's wife. It will never be. Why? He has never liked the princess. Why now? And who do you think will believe you? The king has given his approval. And there is nothing you can do to stop them. Nobody will believe you. No, your decision doesn't count at all. I know. I know my decision doesn't count. I also know that Ubunike does not love the princess. He's heading for something. I will not let it happen. And what is that, if I may ask? I don't know exactly. I will definitely find out. Do you think anybody will believe you? All I am asking is for you to focus on yourself. Forget about this. Mother. Leave the princess and open the gate Mother. alone. Leave them. Mother. You know me very well. I do not go back on my word. I will fight with the last drop of my blood. My son, you are all I have and I don't want to lose you. That's why I'm begging you. You are not. This be. You're not going to lose me. I am not going to lose the princess. I want Zintiano. Listen to your mother. Listen to her advice right now. Inano? Is there anything you know about me? So I do not go back on my words. I'm not a loser. Mm. You can't go back on your words. Hmm? You had the opportunity to have this girl by your side. You had every opportunity to win her love over. But what did you do? You played with it. You played with it automatically. Have you forgotten there's this saying that goes like this? If you love something so much, eh, and you're really sure you're in love with this thing, let it go. If it comes back to you, finally, that means it is yours. But if it doesn't come back at all, one name, couple, it was never yours. You understand me? Ebunike is not here to play. And you remember vividly, that when you fought him, he don't have any money. Eh? And it was a suicidal mission. Now that he's back in this village with a whole lot of money, my brother, what do you think? Eh? It will be 
be more than suicide. Don't even think about that at all. Also, I'm sure you're conversant with the saying. But if you want something so badly, if you love something so badly, you go for it no matter what. All I'm seeing in the future is disastrous. It's disastrous, oh, my brother. Good. Also, look at me. You will see that I am ready to fight the last drop of my blood. You will fight with the last drop of your blood. Is that what you just said? Eh? I knew it! I knew it! You're a wicked man. You never loved your mother. A woman that carried you in her womb for complete nine months. You don't love her. You have never said you will fight for your mother until the last drop of your blood. Because of a girl, you want to fight. You want to die. You want to make your mother childless. Because of a woman. Hey! You're wicked. You are wicked. You're a wicked son. You're a wicked son. Listen. This man in question is in this village. He is fortified. He is prepared. He is ten times richer than you. The money he has now, even your next generations unborn can never see it. Remove your hand from what is bigger than you. Otherwise, this is your two legs. They will take it off. You will join the prince. I wonder how you work with her. In times like this, even courageous men entertain fear. But fear is a luxury I cannot afford. Mm. You know why? What I feel for the princess is way deeper than any level of fear. Bravo. <laughs> you have been reading. You have been reading books behind me. Eh? You have been reading several books, different books, poems, just to make the princess feel you're a soft man. But, my guy, I have done my bit. The only thing I will tell you here and now is that let the power of love lead you through. My love for you is for real. Love is for real. I need some proof for you to understand my feelings for you. I need some time for you to know that I cannot do it. Listen. Listen. For the very last time, I am warning you, stay away from the princess. Stay away from the princess. Why are you shouting at me? You mean you came all the way to my house to rant at me? Do you know you are disturbing the neighborhood? Well, all I see is a hunter. A hunter who is supposed to be sleeping. I will advise you to go back to sleep. For what I'm seeing now, it's not reality. You came to my house, Chief Obuma de Janga. The only man that kills without going to prison to rant and warn me. The fact that a man is peaceful doesn't mean he's unskilled at war. Kabudike, do not take my leniency for foolishness, for weakness. I'm warning you, stay away from the princess. You know, little boys, who doesn't know the sound of war? Always crave for war. I will not say anything for now. But if you know you are man enough, I am inviting you to the palace tomorrow. For tomorrow is the day of my introduction. Then I shall know if you are truly a man or a mere village hunter. All right. We shall see. Boss, I heard you talking to someone. Who was that? Hmm. It's chicken. Oh. Boss, why don't you allow us win this thing? Don't worry. He's just a boy. I know how to deal with him. Bosma, hmm? Bosma, I don't enjoy killing. No. I will, I they get A1 for killing. I know they fail exam for killing. Let me like this boy now. One shot. It is not your time to waste your bullets. Allow him to go for now. Yes, boss.
appreciate it. Your royal majesty. The Ebedike Akebujuwa one of Oulu Kingdom. Greetings, our elders. You are all welcome. How are they about saying here and get it? Please, could you people tell us why you are here? Oh. <coughs> oh. Um, Your Highness, my elders, uh, you know, um, it is not possible for a man to climb the tree and end up plucking an unripe fruit. At all. Never. Yes. <laughs> Without wasting much time, our brother here saw a beautiful garden. Mm -hmm. He entered. Knowing fully well that a gardener owns it. Then he keep on searching for a beautiful fruit. <laughs> Unfortunately, and finally he found a very wonderful fruit. <laughs> and you all know there's no way he will pluck the fruit without letting the owner know. <laughs> That's why we enter this royal family. To tell you that we are interested in that beautiful thing that has happened to this family. That is why we are here. Um, it is only an elder who does not know the symbols of parted with Golanos that cause it a child's plant. <laughs> From your explanation, you want a flower that we planted. You don't want to be a team stealing without our knowledge. For that, we welcome you with an open arms. Thank you for receiving us. Mm. You're welcome. You're welcome. Young man, if we bring out the beautiful fruit or whatever, could you identify her? Of course, you know. <laughs> God! <laughs> yes, come in, Mr. Rodney. Come in. You can lie up here. <laughs> Young man, which of them? Oh. She's the one. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. young man and are you aware that he's coming today <laughs>
a flat tire. Oh, I don't think I just put down the tire. The tire has put down one. Yes. Look at this. Is so no, 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 no. This is this is this is more than coincidence. This is more than coincidence. Or did we package someone so what land or what? No. Do we even have to tire? Ha! Just don't no no we don't have we don't have more time to waste. Just go and get a fucking either. Baron, go and look for a organizer. What's all this now? Let's let live here. What's all? You see, if someone had told me that you are serious in this your quest of marrying the princess, I would never believe it. I thought this is our usual game plan. What game? kind of game? Game? If you want to play games, there are a lot of beautiful girls in the city you can do that about. Not that hard to cap with a girl you want to kill yourself over. That means both of you don't know me yet. So all this while we have spent together, you don't still know me. I am that man that never misses opportunity. When I see any opportunity, I go for it and I grab it with both hands. It's so simple here. The king of my kingdom offered his daughter for marriage and the reward is that anyone that marries the princess automatically becomes the head of the throne and you expect me chief Obuma the Jenga one to just sit down and watch such a glorious opportunity skip away no 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 I don't do that I don't do that opportunity they say comes but once the plan is this when I marry the princess I become the head of the throne. Then, as, a, as the head of the throne, what I will do is to fasten the king's death by killing him myself because I cannot wait. I can't be patient enough to allow him to die in a sort of death. I will kill the king. And by the time I kill the king, I become the king of the kingdom. Wow. And then I will allow the princess to give me a hair, a, a prince that will succeed me by the time I become the king. Then I will also kill the princess. And go and get myself a sharp Filipino <laughs> girl. A sharp girl that I will marry. Nice because you don't expect me to marry a girl that skipped like this. It's not possible, now. <laughs> huh? It's not possible. I can't do that. And wow. when I become the king, I will make you the Onohu of my kingdom. And ah. you shall be the paramount chief of my kingdom. And together, we shall make and suck a holy kingdom. Let me tell you one more thing. When I become the king, I will collect two, two plus of land from every member of the kingdom. And I will give you about 25 hectares. Hey. And you, 25 hectares. Mm. Two, 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 and we shall continue making and sucking a holy kingdom. That's good. Nice plan. Go and get me a organizer. Let's live here. Ooh, yeah. Delay is not denial. What will be will be nature. I, I was there, you know, after I finished deflecting the tires, I was there waiting for them. I was in the bush hiding, uh, waiting for them to finish fixing it. What is wrong with you? Is that what I told you? Do you want to put yourself into trouble? Ha. I said after deflecting the tire, you move. Eh? Uh -huh. I wanted to go, but my other mind was saying I should stay back. I wanted to go again. My other mind said, stay back, stay back, relax. Okay, I said, okay, let me let me obey us all the great. I relaxed. I was watching them from there. I was watching them until they finished fixing the car. Everything went well. They fixed it well. But this kingdom is in trouble. So, Should I tell you? Should I? As I was hiding there, hmm? watching them fixing the car, I overheard that wicked man, uh, Ibuniki, overheard him telling his friends that he came with his intention towards the princess. And guess what he said? <clears throat> that man said that he, he would kill the king of this land. Hey! We are finished. We are finished. That man is wicked. No, just that, too. Should I tell you more? Ibunike said that. Um, 
after he must have you know gotten an heir from the princess he will also kill the princess and ascend the throne yes he said he will not become the real king and then those friends he came with he will start giving them different positions in this kingdom he will not become a willy the great god forbid hey wickedness crazy things are happening crazy things are happening in this village crazy things I knew it, that this evil man is up to something. Jaja, we're not going to let it happen. We'll fight. We'll try as much as we can to save the princess and the king. You, you will fight. Yes. You and who? You and I. Me and you will, 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 will fight. I said, how now? Why? No, 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 no fight like. Who? Fight, fight who? Eh? What, what is wrong with you, my friend? Are you do you want to just die for nothing? What is your problem? You want to fight? Eh? Do you know those men? Those men and all these villagers, so these those men came from the city. In fact, there was one I was looking at. I, I think that one came from Iran. Those men are wicked. It's not the, the kind of guns these people are using are not the kind of guns we use in hunting here. Yeah. Do you know the kind of gun these people are using? They are using AK. AK 47. Hey! Machine Perere! Those kind of ones that when you set it like this, eh? You aim. Tatim. Tatim. Grip. Grip. Tap, tap, tap. You just die. Two seconds. You want to go and fight them? God forbid. God, you don't, you don't like me. You're a wicked friend. Avoid me. Avoid me, please. Ah. Where are you going? Where, where, where are you going? Every time, every time. Every time you, you, you want to start running. Where are you going? It's not about wearing black and black. Don't, don't ever try it. Don't go there. This will finish you. They will just kill you. Cry, cry. Mr. Cry, cry. Fats. Don't shoot, don't shoot, don't shoot. Go ahead. Don't shoot him. Tell them to flash. Shoot. What are you waiting for? Everybody, what are you waiting for? Instruct your criminals to shoot. Chikalu. Chikalu, eh? The beast in you will soon disappoint you. The day of reckoning will soon be here. I know why I'm keeping quiet. It is because we are from the same village. Do not push me. Chikele, you are pushing me. What will happen? You are pushing me, Chikele. What will happen? Masking here, Willike. What will happen? Do not allow me to pull the trigger. Your introduction today is a mistake. Let it end there. Stole it from the princess. And you will watch me do the main wedding. And you will not cough or do anything. Just like today, when your shadow was not even present at the palace. You will watch me marry the princess and together we shall have lovely kids. You shall watch us with our kids and you will do nothing about it. That will be over my dead body. Then prepare to die. Stay away from the princess. I won't warn you again. Stay away! The deflation of your tire is only just the beginning. So is you. Go ahead. Flash. Chikelue, you are taking too much. You are taking too much, Chikelue. I will cut your wings. Be careful. Now leave this compound. Leave! I will be back. Very last time. Stay away from the princess. Poor hunter. We'll see about it. We will see about it. Stay from the princess. Stay away. So I knew it. I knew this guy is out of something. So he was actually the one that did that. But wait, let me ask you. 
How come you got it for us? This is not funny, boss. His wing get bigger day by day. I hope he didn't hear our conversation. How could he? That's not possible. This boy is becoming a thorn in my flesh. And it's time to put an end to all this nonsense. You will soon know why I'm called Chief of Mother Genda. I kill and I never go to prison. I need to see the king and the princess. Chikilu, what are you doing here? I need to see the king and the princess. It's urgent. Instructions have been passed never to let you in. I know, I know, but please, I need to speak with the king. It's a matter of urgency, please. It is an order from the king. Don't you understand? It's about the life of the king and that of the princess. I need to speak with the king. Chikilu, that's an old tactic. It won't work here. Maybe this will work. Princess, this place is no longer safe for you. You have got to leave this place this minute. Please! I would have loved to follow you. But after seeing what you did to a poor palace guard, I don't think that would be possible. You have to! Please! Your life is in danger and that of the king. You have to leave. Please come with me. What do you mean by our life is in danger? Oh, wonderful, wonderful. Wonderful. <laughs> How could you cook up this very implicating story? Because you want to whisk away my daughter without my knowledge. How could you? Majesty, I would do no such thing. I knew it. I knew it from the start. That you don't like or even love my daughter. You only want to use her and delay her in life. But your secrets are now exposed. My king, you have to believe me. Believe me. I, Ebunike wants to kill you. He wants to take your throne. My king, believe me. I am not your king. You are lucky I'm in a good mood. Otherwise, you would have been a dead meat by now. Take a look at what you did to our royal guard and tell me that you have good intentions for this household. Guards, throw him out of here. Your Majesty, I'm telling you the truth. Ewinike is planning something terrible for this family. Throw him out. Ewinike is planning something terrible for this family. Your Majesty, you have to believe me. He wants to kill you. Yes. He wants to kill you.
My daughter, to be honest with you, kings don't choose their destiny. Destiny chooses them. If you want our lineage to continue, marry Chief. That's the man for you. I wouldn't have pressed on, but I have sacrificed. I refuse to give you another mother, which may bring chaos in future uh, because of an heir. I love your mother so much and that has made me not to take another wife. I have made a lot of sacrifice to keep this family together. And all I am asking from you, my daughter, is to marry Chief. Father, I'm aware of all of your sacrifices, but have you cared to ask your daughter what her heart says? I'm not going to disobey you, but I want you to know that I will be forever unhappy. I know you don't like him. But love grows with time. I want you to do me a favor, my princess. Tomorrow morning, go to Chikalo with some guards and give him a serious warning that you no longer want to see him in this palace again. Uh, that way, you would have cut off your relationship with him and he will know that this one is coming from the horse's mouth. That would be hard, father. I respect his emotions and I care about them. His emotions? Did he care about your emotions when he beat up a palace guard? <sighs> I warned you from the start of this relationship but you will not listen. Uh, that boy is a rook. Whoever is capable of beating up a palace guard is also capable of killing you in marriage. He was just trying to pass a message. Uh, what message was he passing? You're trying to frame up an innocent man? How do you believe such a cock and bull story? I didn't say I believe him, Father, but... But? No but, my dear. Tomorrow morning, I want to hear that you have carried out my instructions concerning Chikelo. Have I made myself clear, my dear? Yes, Father. Good girl. I told them everything, but they seemed not to believe me. Then the king ordered the guards to throw me out. Wait, uh, Chikelo, Chikelo, are you, are you mad? Eh? Are you okay? Do you know that you're a stupid boy? Eh? 
You went and told the king what I told you. Hey! Where is the proof? Where is the proof? Are you not a witness? Me? Where? How? When? Eh? Don't put me into trouble, oh. Don't ever put me into trouble. What is your business? What is your problem? Eh? I told you something, so simple something, that somebody is planning for the king. You went ahead and, and, and told the king. Have you asked yourself, what if I lie to you? Or you go out to confirm? Wait, 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 wait. Are you, I thought you were a great person. I was already great. Are you also a coward? Hmm? A coward? Yes. Who is a coward? Because you're trying to deny. You are the one that is a coward. A big one at that. Eh? How could you? How could you betray me? I told you something. I went there to the palace to start. Great coward. Princess. Princess. Greetings, princess. Save your greetings. Since you have decided to disrespect me, stay away from me. You want me now, princess? No. It's a promise. This is I was just trying to save you. Oh, stop that rubbish! Nonsense. I have warned you. Princess! Princess! Have you seen it? Eh? Have you seen it? You're a goat. A big goat. Man! Man! Cry, cry, baby. That's what you are. Have you seen it? I warned you, Abby. I warned you to be careful of women. Be careful of women in this village, but no, you pay deaf ears to me. Now, see, she have told you, the girl you said you love so much. <laughs> I've told you now that she doesn't want to see you in the palace again. And she added, it's a promise. That means she's serious. I warned you about this girl, okay? I warned you about the princess, cry cry baby. I warned you about this girl. I told you you don't know anything concerning women in this village. I am also the great. Anybody I tell something, the person believes me or follow that footstep, he or she must succeed. But you, my best friend, no. Everything I tell you, no, you don't hack into it. Eh? Now she has told you she doesn't want to ever see you again in the palace. If you go here now, if you go here now, you are busy carrying everything, the push meat, everything. The princess, you hand it over to her. Every, even the one I get, you give it to the princess to claim good boy. <laughs> Mr. Nice Guy. Now, where's the nice guy? No matter what she does, I won't stop being good. You won't stop being good. Or you will stop misbehaving. Eh? You will stop being good or you will stop showing your stupidity. Are you okay? Don't you know that whenever you see a bird dancing, whenever you see a bird misbehaving, jumping up and down, there is something playing music for that bird. That means that bird has a backup. But you, who is backing you up in this village? Nobody. Apart from me in this village, who is backing you up? Nobody. Stay away from the princess and the palace. And never you in your life come to me again for advice because I will not tell you anything. Don't put me in trouble, oh. Don't put me in trouble. I am also the great. I want to do great things and not stupid things like you're doing. Fat, let me get out from here. My princess, why are you full of regrets? You did the best thing. Besides, it's not your fault. It's my fault. I hurt an innocent man. The only man that took me as his younger sister. I hurt a nice innocent man. Why am I so cruel to a nice man? Remember, what you're doing is out of the king's instruction, not your will. Apart from the king's instruction, to get the messed up. By laying his hands on the guard. He shouldn't have done that. Yes, I agree with you. What if he kills him? Enough. Why would you say something like that? About a very nice, kind, innocent man. You two, I don't want to have this conversation again till we get to the palace. Not have I made myself clear? Yes, my princess. Let's go. Oh yeah, I, 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 yeah. Delay is not denial. What will be, will be. Nature will always take us. It doesn't 
Ever since you came back from the message your father sent you, you've been very moody. Why? My queen, it's not fair at all. <sighs> See, I didn't come to talk to you as a queen. I came to see you and talk to you as a mother who talk to a daughter. And I need you to listen to me. Mother, I have hurt an innocent man. No, you didn't hurt anybody. As a matter of fact, you did the right thing. Come to think of it. If you are back getting married to Chikino, and you see a beautiful young lady around him, even when your marriage is approaching, how would you feel? I understand, but the way I went to warn him, the manner I did it was not really nice. It's so unfair. My dear, not everyone learns the easy way. People like Chikilu learn through a hard way. For how long has he been hanging around you without saying a word? And now that the sun is about to shine on you, he wants to become a hindrance. Such a person doesn't need to exist. Mom! Why would you say that? You used to love Chikel. What changed? Yes, I used to. But I stopped when I found that he doesn't want your progress. He doesn't. He does, Mom. He cares about me and I'm sure of it. Really? He cares about you. Yes. So why is he preventing suitors from coming to you? Why? Oh. Think, my daughter. From my observation, you have taken my advice. I have not been seeing the princess around. It's like you two are no longer together. Of course, you are no longer together. Just like you said, there's no point killing ourselves over the princess. She's getting married, so I'll just have to just let her go. I'm so happy. Don't worry, okay? I know it's not easy for you. But your life is more important to me than whatever. Okay? Don't worry. I can see you have drawn wings. But today, I will clip those wings. Shoot! Next time, he won't be this lucky. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Stay away from the princess. Oh, stay away. Stay away. Please. I am Chief Obumado Ejenga. I kill! And you don't go to prison. Good. Thank you, Please. 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 Even with a son of a, a beating a, a, a palace guy. I, I didn't want to get you involved. You didn't want to get me involved. If you know what is good for you, 
go in there, pack your things, and go as far as Abuja, go to your uncle, until all this thing is over. Mama, you know full well I'm not going anywhere. Stay. No, go. Because you're losing it. Look at you. Where is also? You, you are losing it. Do you know you almost lost your mother? Mama, 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 please, please. Sometimes we die for the ones we love. I mean, if this is what it takes to bring justice, then so be it. As what? As a... As Minister of Defense, or what? Mama, please, 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 please. I'm not scared of him. Okay. If you want to please me, the only thing you will do for me is to get out of this village. Leave this village. Mama, no elsewhere. Mama. Please. Please. See, guy, you know, try at all. You should have allow us to waste that guy there. I detest you. We can't do 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 no no they shake shake like say we no get liver. Eh? Ordinary woman no they do do they no no they shake shake. Allow us buy this guy now. We get a one for killing. We they go school for killing. We they pass our exam for killing. Maybe the guy they think how he want to die for his mama hand. See, uh, uh, both of you are very wrong. Immediately we got there. As soon as one shoot, I remember the promise I made to myself. I made a promise that that guy will live to see me marry the princess. But I will not kill him or the I marry the princess. See me, let me tell you, yeah. That guy seeing me marry the princess will kill him faster than bullets. I know what I'm doing. See, make I tell you, Obelenshine may be killed. The way we they handle this guy, we they handle this guy like saying now one kind. Now one kind, one kind lord. That guy, eh? Guy will get liver, gather mora. Gather liver, chop liver, chop liver, join the liver. Go palace, break the laws, break the customs, still break tradition on top. Come beat palace guard, woto woto. Now you they talk, say, now guy, eh? Guy, you don't, they, you don't do like say you get chicken liver now. Now, gather, gather mora come now. Mora calm down, I have, my, I have my reasons. What stupid reasons? Tell me, what stupid reason? See, remember I am still the boss of this gang. We are just giving you the privilege because we are in your town and you have mission here. Don't tell me to calm down. Please, please, don't let anyone hear what you hear. Don't anyone, lower your voice. Huh? Don't come and spoil my business for me. Don't you know the deal? I have a mission in this village, please. I know you are my boss. I also like my Oga. Eh? But for now, just make it maintain. Make it bad people don't go hear you, I beg. I don't make anybody hear what you just talk. Now don't talk again, I beg. Make it not spoil my business for me. Yeah? See, one promise why they tell you this is eh? After my marriage with the princess, he will join his ancestors. Trust me. No, they do do they don't know. No con they shake shake for us. So. Me, yeah, I no get chicken liver out. No do do no no. No do do no no. Come be like saying that thing and Tom and Jerry things we gonna do for this village. Uh, see, I uh, see, I see this one. I may tell you the truth then. Eh? Make you just calm down a little, a little, eh? After my wedding with the princess, he will join his ancestors. I will send them go to where where you know come back again. Just give me some more time. Your head still your hand. Make I tell you. Hey! Oga Monday! 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 Oga Something different, something great. You know, say that maybe also the great now. Also the great. Fine. So I need to do great things, you know, greater things. So I think of something new. Also, this way they talk like this. So you know, carry bush meat. Come, you can't go see that. So you can't they talk about business. What do you want to do now? Yeah, brother, I know it's you. Like I like I tell you before, this bush meat business, you know, be like what I really want to. And because I, I'm a village boy, and that my friend, they always they. 
push me. I'll be great, man. I get great future. You understand? Make I not go define bushmeat now. One day now, bushmeat gonna define me. So make I leave bushmeat, enter better business. I true, it's also. And you know that I come, I see. Not be this keke I see. I see some other keke they write for sale. Now nah, this one again for sale. Ah, uh, you don't do keke business. No, not true. My brother, what's gonna happen? They say you get people who get keke where they want sell. Mm. They will bring the keke come my shop so they will pack them. Mm. They will tell me how much they where they want sell them. I'll call say call as much. You can't get my own call so that's so what they do and so. Hey, Monday, Monday. <laughs> now also we do for street. Well, so Monday, you say, uh, you just worry we go eh. Uh, you just say I go spoil. Uh, this keke where they half an hour. Uh, how the keke be? The keke they okay, sha. Ha, Monday. This always say they okay, sha. What thing be the sha with inside? No, the keke do okay. Oh. Uh. I don't shake the keke in a legit. Everything go. Just that the owner gets small challenge. Mm. We need money, cash involved. Me, it takes that to him problem. This why if you buy a soul, I don't enter a road. Uh, uh, so how much? How much you keep up? Uh, the owner be put up for three fifty or oh. ah three fifty. Uh, but if now you want buy a soul, if you talk to the owner, me if he give it for two fifty. Ah. Uh. Uh, but you go give me smart number, take uh, you understand. No be wala now. That one no be problem. Uh, so two fifty, I go carry. So you don't carry a so you don't enter a road. They also don't upgrade now. Uh, hey. Cause I want to enter road now. From road now, I go the fly. Oh, sorry, great. From there, I will see Jesus. Hey, that's true. That's true. The keke day okay. okay. Uh, when no, you want buy and so, I uh, like money. Oh, my go think about them now. Ah, uh, uh, the people there, everything they complete. Uh, everything they like it. They they not like this. My go think about them. I will get back to you. Oh yeah, now. Uh, make a define my way now. But well, make it day. Just keep up. Uh, if you know say you want buy and so, maybe you will do pick come. Uh, no, come, come. Just keep up. Uh, you know say that uh, cash and carry. I know now. Just keep up. Uh, I will come, eh? Monday. Make I finish now. this thing while they do so. Uh, Monday, man, they go. I'll see you on Tuesday. Go oh, on, Allah. Who is in there? Ah, chicken. What is the problem? Do you want to break my door? Eh? Where is your stupid son, Ebunike? You must be very stupid. You must be very, very stupid. This selling money you are seeing an elderly woman like me. Is this a good money you should tell me? Or have you lost your manners? I have not come here to exchange words with you. I know of his evil plans to kill the king and the princess. It won't work. As long as I live, it won't work. What will you do if it works? What will you do, Obu Mado? Do you think you can kill me or my son? The way you go about killing every living thing, including human being. Let me tell you, you will not make heaven. Yes, you will not make heaven. Sit down there, wait for my son to come back from his hotel room, so that both of you will do it man to man. Okay. I know of his evil intentions to kill the king and the princess for his selfish interest, but as long as I live, it will not happen. You must be very stupid. You must be very stupid. It won't you happen. Eh? You must be very stupid. Murder of a criminal. Killer. Murder oh, of a criminal. Way. Mother of a oh, criminal. Oh, mad way. Oh, Mother of a criminal. You are going to hell fire. Mother of a criminal. You will not make heaven. Mother of a criminal. You are going to hell fire. Oh, go mad. Oh, go mad. The hunter, you will still be the hunter. I know of ya. This boy. I hope this boy is not running to gang put us in trouble. Hey. Shouldn't I go just go and kill him now? Shouldn't I just go and look for something to kill this boy now? Hey, hey. Mama, calm down. Just calm down. Hmm? Nothing will happen and nothing will ever happen. Ebunike, you need them to be here to see what Chikelu came to do in my house. He was telling me that I should tell you that he knows your plan. In fact, that boy knows too much. Mama. Wait, wait. What do you mean he knows too much? Hey! But he knows my plan. You needed to see that Chikelu when he came here this morning. Do you know he didn't even greet me? Rather, he was, he was, he was bragging, insulting me, and asked me to tell you that he knows all your plans to kill the princess, kill the king, hmm? and take over the throne. Boss, can you imagine? Mama, we have told Boss who we should just silence that idiot once and for all. You did? I did. You will make heaven. You will make heaven. See, Egunike, do you still want to make heaven? 
Mama, of course you know I always, always wanted to go to heaven. You have to do whatever you need to do very quickly. Mama, that boy cannot tarnish your image. Mama, I will tell Chikelo that I am chief. <laughs> I kill and I never go to prison. <laughs> I will deal with him. Do you kill and you bury because you want to go to heaven? Now that Princess Mama and also have lost hope in me, is there any reason I should risk my life? No. I think I have to listen to the advice my mother gave me. I need to get out of this village. After all, Enrique is fully aware that I know all he knows. Of course. My mother must have told him. If anything happens, there will be no one to stand by me. If I continue this journey, I might put my mother in danger. From all observations, the princess has moved on. I have to do the same. God, give me the courage to look away. Oh Lord, let your will be done. Little boy, I want you. I want you, but you wouldn't listen. If you like, shout from now to the end of the world. No one will save you. Because you are in the middle of nowhere, like the points of no return. So this is you. <laughs> I thought kidnapping you would be one hell of a difficult job. You just do 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 the no no. So if you go mama put go buy liver, I go to say you don't get that liver, Abby. <laughs> what did they give this boy Mora self? What did they give you Mora love? That's what gives me the morale. Love. You cannot underestimate the power of love. Did I hear you say love? Did I just hear you say love? Listen, you might be looking so quiet and innocent, but you will never confuse me with this your innocent look. People like you are more dangerous than the green snake in the green grass. We are in this game together. I know what you're up to. Your self-determination is imbued. Come on. We are in this game together. We are not in this game together. Ebunike. Point of correction. Chief Obumadu Ejenga. I kill, but I never go to prison. Whatever. Yours is for your own selfish interest. But mine is genuine. Mine is strictly out of love. Chikelo. We are not on the same page. Chikelo. My mother told me you know a lot about our plans. And that is the more reason why you are not going to live here alive. That reminds me. I want to beg you for a favor. Please, do not die anytime soon. Because I want you to be alive and witness my marriage with the princess and not the mother of the king. <laughs> yes. That reminds me. You think it was your mother's interference that stopped me from killing you that day? <laughs> not at all. I would have killed both of you and nothing would happen. Nobody would cough. But I personally allowed you to live so that you will witness the day I will take the princess to the altar to be wedded as my lovely wife. Then I will allow you to join your ancestors in peace. Let me make you a promise, Ebunike. Your plans will never work. Who yeah, hey, 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 h
Sometimes you don't fight for something Sometimes you don't drag for something Sometimes nature will take its place Oh no, oh no, no, no No matter how fast you try Oh yeah, whatever will be, will be No matter how hard you try to get it If it's not your own It cannot walk on The power of nature Is beyond human's knowledge Who yeah, I, I Who yeah, I, 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 I Who yeah, I, I Who yeah, I, 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 I Delay is not Step at a time. I did not see Chikilu. And what dream are you talking about? Ah, it was so real. My son's life is at stake. I don't think Chikilu is safe wherever he is. I don't Mama, think Mama, so. calm down. Chikilu is fine. I actually came to see him so I can show him my new KK I bought. Uh -huh. eh? A brand new one. Yes, uh -huh. and uh, probably he must be somewhere to seek for refuge. Don't refuge, worry, he's, he's Without fine. Without telling me or you, no, no, he's not like that. My son is not safe. Fiko, what is wrong with him? Where is he now? And where did he go to? Wait, so, Mama, are you trying to tell me that you, you slept here? You yes. passed the night here? While I was waiting for Chikelina, he didn't come back. I slept off. Hey! Mama, uh, you, you passed the night here. You're not scared? Scared eh? of what? Oju Kalaba can come and bite you or carry you. There is nothing more important to me than Chikelina. Hey. His life is not safe. Where is he? Okay. Eh? Uh, Mama, it's okay. It's okay. Calm down. Like I said before, nothing will happen to your son. Okay. Eh? I, will, I will look for him. Eh? Okay. He will come back. Uh, please, please. Can you take me to the palace? Palace, quoi? Uh -huh. I should take you. No, <laughs> Mama, you can't go to the palace now. There is like Iraq and Iran fighting. That, that palace now is palace of war. Uh -huh. So nobody goes there right now. Okay, no problem. Eh? I will look for him. Uh, he will no come back. No problem. Don't worry yourself. Uh -huh. I will go by myself. Oh, oh no, no. Oh, Mama, you can't go now. Uh -huh. You can't go by yourself. You, you really want to go there? I want to ask him really. Can't quite get where you really want to go there. I want to go. I know your son is very stubborn. He might be sober and, and don't worry. I will. I will. Chikelu is nowhere. I'm going to the palace. If you want to take me there, you take me. If you don't take me, I will go on my own. It's okay. I will take you there. Uh, uh, let me lock the door. Chikelu! Food is ready. Food is ready. Not before dead people. Hmm? So you go choose between knife and gun. Which one you go take that? Please, please. I don't want to die. Please. Spare my life, please. Take that to a man of God. 
because I am a man of war. The mother of chicken. What are you talking about? And what are you doing here? You are a bad mother who cannot caution her son. I presume you are aware uh, that your son beat up one of my royal guards. That is why I'm here to say I am sorry. Look at you. Something that happened days ago. You're just here to say you're sorry. Anyway, it's a case of like mother, like son. No, I was waiting for your anger to come down before I come to say sorry. Well, my anger is still where it is. Now, get out of this palace, both of you, before I lose it on you. Uh, get out! We will leave. We will leave, but just grant me one wish. Just one. Let me have my son. <laughs> Mama, why are you on your news? My son is missing since yesterday. Missing? Yes. Where did he tell you he was going? I left him at home. Did you see him? Does she look like your son's keeper? Honestly, Mama, I didn't see him. Please. Uh, Mama, it is obvious Chikelu is not here. Please, let, let's, let's go home. Please, my princess, if by any means you see my son, tell him I am dying slowly. Daddy, you please come home, please. Let's go. Leave. Who ye 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 to please beg your son. I am here as a friend and a mother. You are a mother like me, please. My son is missing. Your son came to my place a few days back and threatened to kill my son. I pleaded with him. Three days after, my son is missing. I don't know where he is, that's why I came to you to talk to your son. Please, if he knows anything about my son, if you could name me. Ego, the first of all, first of all, Biko. Please. Ego, if you don't sit down, I will not answer you. Hey, sit down. Please, oh, for next time, don't kneel down for me again. I don't want to miss heaven. Biko, uh -huh. did you just say that your son is missing? Son is missing. Hey! Chinekenna. Ah! I don't know his whereabouts, oh. And I'm sure my son, too, is innocent. Please talk to your son. Whatever my son has done wrong, I am begging on his behalf. Please help me. He's the only one I have. I am a poor widow. I don't know anywhere to go to. I don't have any other child anywhere. <laughs> please, my fellow woman, please help me and talk to your son. Hey, God, see, you are not the only widow here. So I understand the pain of a widow when it he, when he has to do with only child. Do you understand me? But let me tell you, you see this, my son, that all of you are jealous in this village. You see this, my son, everybody just talking about him. Eh? My hard-working son that minds his business. He's a kind, 
hearted young man, full of human sympathy, who can't even hurt a fly. So, what will I be doing with kidnapping your son? Of what use would that make? Eh? Veronica. Please, oh. Please. Ha. I only say, you should ask him if he knows my son's whereabouts. He must have done it out of anger. Maybe my son looked for his trouble or something. Please. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That body just said it. That your son is a troublemaker. Very notorious. No. Who goes about looking for people's trouble all over this village? Who does not know him? It's possible he must have committed an offense. He must, even the other day, uh -huh, the day he came here, that your son came to my house, had the infantry to insult me. Mwawu Veronica. Mwawu Veronica insulted my millionaire son, insulted his bodyguards. But you know what? We didn't touch him. All. Because my son is a kind-hearted young man who is on his way to make heaven. He did not touch him. He will allow him to go scot-free. I know, I uh -huh. know that. Even the day your son came to my house, said he's going to shoot my son. I pleaded with him and he listened to me. Oh. He listened to me all the same. Talk to your son. Oh. Who does not know my son in this village? Who does not know my son? The wonderful one. The wonderful son. Honor his zoo. He doesn't steal. He doesn't kill anyone. He's only doing runs and making his genuine money. Who oh. does not know him? He respects everyone, respects every elder, takes every elderly woman like his own mother, which you are not exempted. Hey! Am I lying? One. Major. Major. My only son, my only son. God, who have I offended? Have you forgotten? Forgive me. Hey, God. You remember hey! your, son? your son is a hunter. Have you forgotten? He's a hunter mm -hmm. who goes about killing every living thing at the other comes his way. He must have killed somebody and they kidnapped him. Ha! Mama, please, you need to stop this thing you're doing. Stop crying. <laughs> it's not good for you. Biko, please stop crying. I strongly believe that your son Chikelu is safe and sound wherever he is. <laughs> I just pray nothing happened to my son. I pray he's safe. Oh, I pray. Mama, nothing has happened. Uh -uh. It's fine. It's fine. And one more thing, Mama. I, I want you to do something for me. Give me. Please. Um, I, I want you to stop searching for your son. Why can you ask me to stop searching for my son? Look at the few days that he is not around this house. Everywhere is just quiet and lonely. And you are asking me not to search for him. I can see you are not a good friend. No, 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 no. Uh, Chikelu is my best friend, though. my buddy buddy. Uh, no, that was not what I meant. I, I mean that we should stop searching for him. Uh, because I strongly believe that uh, Ebunike is with Chikelu. Your son Chikelu is in his position. As I speak. believe that man had a hand in the kidnap of my son. I know it. And I know that God will punish him. Amen. God will punish him again. That man is an evil man. God will surely judge him. Before God judge him, I, I have a plan. Yes. What is the plan? Um, Mama, you know, before you uh, fight a strong man, you must plan and then know how to attack. Um, the plan I have now is, you know, I am also the great, so anything I say stands because I, I have sense. Your son knows me. He knows about it. I want us to act as if we don't care. Yes, mm -hmm. for now. I want us to act as if we don't care about your son's disappearance. So that he will think that we don't even want him. You understand? Uh -huh. So then I will go my underground search. I will look for him. Wherever he is, and so long as he's in this village. In fact, even if he's in abroad, I will go. I will take flight. No problem. I can do anything with my best friend. I must look for him. I must make sure that I find him. Yes, so if I go and search now, I will definitely know where they kept him. And I will bring him back life. Thank Same. you very much. Good. And God will bless you, Ona. Please. Bless you too. Bless you. Don't don't worry yourself. All I want you to do now is to stay calm, mm? relax your mind, and please don't stress yourself. Make a high blood pressure. Mm -hmm. I won't. We brought you breakfast. Thank you. Oh, 
Ah, I've been waiting for it. I'm hungry. Eh? Please. Push. Yes, you brought your food. Show mercy, please. Show mercy. I'm sorry. Pretty. Have you ever seen a man as nice as our boss? Thank God for our boss. His sympathy is second to none. Can I... Can I please... Have water? How? Water, my, my, my throat is dry, please. Oh, oh. Really? Yes. You need water? Water. Oh, this, let me get some water. 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 You need water? Yes. Oh. Water. 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 You need water? Water. You need water? Water. <laughs> that is the water. You need the water? That is the water. This is water. This is water. This is fucking water. Okay? This is water. Let's go. You see? Our boss asked us to bring this food so you can eat and stay alive to withstand the shock for his soon coming wedding to the most disgusting princess. You don't fuck up! Princess, what is the meaning of this? Why are you stressing yourself over nothing? What do you mean by over nothing? The only son of a widow is missing and you expect me to pop champagne. I don't even know your business with that tout. Watch your tongue. Chikelu is not a tout. Maybe because you never met him. Chikelu is a very nice person. He could actually give his life for you. Listen, princess. Whatever you have for him is in the past now. Besides, which normal man will beat up a palace guard? Just to come and see someone. That's barbaric. Enough. I think I know what to do. There will be no marriage until Chikeli is found. What? Princess! What did you just say? Don't even let the king hear this. Else, you'll be making him unhappy. You know how happy he has been all this while we are preparing for this marriage. I came all the way from Lagos just because of this. Think of how many people you'll be disappointing, including the queen mother. Do they even care? Do they even care how I feel concerning this marriage? <sighs> they do. You may not like the whole thing for now, but as time goes on, you will understand that they mean well for you. It is that good for nothing boy that doesn't mean well at all. How can one stand by the door, blocking other people from gaining entrance to see such a beautiful jewel like you? That's more barbaric. See, Chikel is not an evil person. Okay, can you believe that all the while we've been together, he has never touched me? He's only waiting for the right time to tell me how much he loves me. You should be happy that you're getting married to Chief Obuma de Jenga. I would rather be poor and be happy than to be rich and cry my eyes out. Yes. At least you'll not be crying in this country. You'll be crying in the US. <laughs> know how sweet it is to live there. You really need to change your thinking faculty. Forget it, it's changed already. Leave me alone, I beg. You look. Mwah. My princess, you're so beautiful. My princess, don't you like it? If you don't like it, I can start all over again. Oh, no, no, this is beautiful. Yeah. 
for, for my expression. She doesn't like it. Mm. Okay, now you are done with your job. You can excuse us. All right, ma'am. I'm in love with you. I cannot pretend. From the depth of my heart, I love you. Nyemo bigi, onyem furu nanya. Nyemo bigi, achalu gongwanyi. I'm dying for you. I'm dying for you, baby. Princess, I don't like the way you're looking. Today is supposed to be your happiest day. What happened? I don't like it, honestly. You will not understand. I thought we've talked these things before. Why didn't you try assuming a buried issue? What if your husband should be walked in and see you like this? This issue is not buried yet until Chikeli is found. Please, my princess, cheer up. Hmm? Don't do this. Please. How can I be this heartless? No. Tell me. How am I supposed to marry the same man? that is responsible for the disappearance of my chicken. How? My princess, you can't be too sure. Are you sure that old woman is not trying to poison your, your mind against Chief Obumade Jenga and thus marriage? Are you sure about that? I know Chikelu's mother so well. She can never do such a thing. I'm scared. Don't trust people easily. Anyone can pull a stunt. The very one you think will not hurt you, we actually be the one that does. So cheer up, my princess, okay? Is that not a bunny case car? Ah, I thought his wedding is today. What is he doing here? This man must be up to something, you know. And I must know that thing today. I must know what he is up to today.
little boy. Little boy. <laughs> I know the pain from my little torture has made you to forget what today is. Well, I am here to break the news. Such a pity news. Such a sad news to you. Today, I will take the princess as my lovely wife. No, no, please. Please. Obu Mane Jeronga. Yes. Spare my life. I want to go home. Oh! He wants I to go, want to go home. home. He <laughs> wants to go home. <laughs> Listen. No, no, no. Please. I will not send you home. Maybe I will do that this evening. Please. Or probably tomorrow morning. That is if I still have the energy. After tearing that veil of the princess. What do we do? Which you are so scared of. Please, 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 please. You know you are such an idiot. I know. A hey, weekly. I know. You had every opportunity in this world to dismantle the princess. But you couldn't do it. You lost a glorious opportunity. But you see, I, Chief Obuma de Jenga, I don't take chances. It's today, it's our honeymoon starts immediately. <laughs> and then, I will come back and send you you to the great beyond. Don't do this, please. You see? Only <laughs> can please don't do this. You are such an idiot. An increase in your next life when given such opportunity. Use it wisely. Guys, let's go. I will bring a cup of power wine for you. No, 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 no. I don't do it at all. Change that for you. Change that for you. Two seconds. Come on. Take this drink, go there, out there, and bring that man that is after your heart, my princess. Come on. That's my princess. My beautiful daughter. That's all right. Hey, <laughs> 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 
Non-entity. Do you know the penalty of what you are doing? I know what I'm saying, my king. This man here, Gunike, is a murderer. He killed his uncle. He killed Ozadima. He is saying the truth. He took us to where he was buried. No! Hey, Asif! The assassin was committed alongside his mother. Asif! Hey, 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 look at her. See her there. Hey! Hey! Now look! Look at her! Look at her! Look at her! Look at her. Hey! 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 I said it! I said it! Hey! 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 The day I saw my friend who's was my last, he was very furious. He said he was going to see his, uh, his uh, nephew. That was the last time we saw him. He disappeared. I see. I see. My king, on that fateful day, it all happened like this. Bury him. Hey, Bunike. Hey. I said you should dig the grave now. Bury him fast. Mama, I, that was very difficult too. Do you want to disobey me? No, Mama. Remember, obey your father and your mother so that your days may be long. Do you want to live long? Yes, Mama. Ngwadik. Hi. Hey. Mama. Mama, this is very hard. You, you understand now? Nah? Hey, Bunike. Egunike, dig this ground. Dig it! Don't you want to make heaven? I want to make heaven. Don't you want to go to heaven? I want to go to heaven, Mama. Mwa no dig. This is the only way to make heaven. Mwa! This man, Egunike, killed him and sold his land eh? alongside his mother. Your Majesty! Her Majesty! He's a conspiracy, he's a liar. Your Majesty, take a look at my son and I. Do we look like people that cannot fly? We are peaceful people that are working so hard to make heaven. My son and I are born again Christians. Eh? We cannot kill. This boy was spent, and you would never make heaven. But I'm a child in heaven. Will he you make heaven? The police just confirmed that he never had to heaven. heaven. Confirm. Confirm what? It's a conspiracy thing I don't know. Even you, you are part of it. All of you conspired against my son! Enemies hey. of progress! Watch your mouth, madam. Are you saying that the police conspired against you and your son? Yes! Yes! Is it today? How do you have been conspiring against, against innocent people in this, in this, in, in, in this nation? Eh? Is, 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 how do you have been conspiring against innocent citizens? Eh? Is it even the first time? Eh? Everybody get! Call Commissioner, call Governor, call Senator, call all of them because this is an abuse of our fundamental human rights. You can never make heaven. 
I will make sure you don't enter heaven. It is obvious that this man here was paid to do this. Yes. He was paid to do this because they are all angels seeing me marry the princess. If not so, my, my, your majesty, how would a dead man talk to him? Oh. How would a dead man talk to this man here? He was paid to do this, your majesty. Your majesty, like I said, it also happened like this at some fateful day. Please, don't kill me, please. Please, you will not die. You will not die. Thank you. As long as you do what I ask you to do. Ebonike and Veronica killed me because of my life. You are the only witness. You are the only one who can expose them. I will stand by your side as long as you comply with my demands. Go and tell what you saw. How are we? Go! Go, Go and, and tell, tell what, what you saw. saw. So, you lied to me and told me that you returned from Singapore. Oh no. Now I hereby declare that the land you stole from Ozodima is hereby a community land. And with the powers bestowed on me as the Akep Uchiongwa. Are you surprised? This is it for you. You are done. So unfortunate, your gangler is dead. It's a wrap for you. Young man, who are you? Greetings, Your Highness. Greetings. My name is George Eric. This young man right here is a thief. He stole my car. I was held against my will. I was accustomed, apprehended. And my car was taken away from me by this young man and his gang. I had some money in the car. $100,000 was in the car. I was able to track the car. With a GPS installed in the car, I was, I was able to monitor his movements. He's a thief. How dare you? How dare you come to this palace to lie to the king? How dare you deceive my daughter with false wealth, stolen wealth? Look at you! You will suffer all the days of your life. Your Highness, I'm Inspector Collins from Force Headquarters. Young man, you're under arrest for stealing. Officer, yes, look at him. Look at the man here. Arrest him. Arrest this fool, this criminal, this nigga who. It's an app for you. Arrest him! Mr. Ebunike, you are under arrest for the kidnap of one Mr. Chicken. Chicken, my, my best friend. An attempted kidnap. Yes. You are asked to remain silent because anything you say or do will be used against you in the court of law. Hey! Officers. We are going to show. Arrest him. Remove that scam from his head! Yeah. Officer, come back! Don't waste your thread on that man. Look at the wife. Remove that Move! 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 Arrest him!
Uh, greetings, uh, Chikelo. Uh, we had of your ordeal. Uh, but we thank God you're back now and you're well. So I came to see you to uh, tell you that we are sorry about what happened to you. And also to tell you that that man that came and to marry my daughter, who wanted to take your place, was an imposter. He's a thief. And now he's in prison. I want to tell you that my family and I were sorry for the way we treated you. I have come to tell you that I wholeheartedly give my daughter to you in marriage. Hey, thank you, Ibu. Yes. I want you to come with your people to the palace to do the needful and take your wife. I also invite you because you are now a member of the royal household to move in if you want to. Sorry for the way we have treated you. Thank you. My princess, welcome, my daughter. meet your husband. of my heart I love you nye mo bigi o nye mfuru nanya nye mo bigi So 